ain't scary ass. And there's a million of they ass though. Look at Walt. Look at Low Walt. Look at Low Walt. Look at Low Walt. Look at Low Walt. Now, we moving on to the uh to this footage, man. Of the goddamn it, the gang members getting into a fight with the Venezuelans, man. A whole bunch of black gang members getting in the alley, damn near centered up with um, a whole bunch of Venezuelans. The Venezuelans was deeper than the black people type shit, and you know. Some of the girls that was on the black people side end up up in phones and you know, you know, like they was just woofing at each other, but they just get keep getting closer and closer to each other. And then, you know, um, I can't see what the Venezuelans got, but I can see on the on the black people side, like I think they was picking up poles. This one dude picked up this big ass stick, you know what I'm saying? They was walking close to each other. But if you look closely, I probably had to blur it out. Y'all probably couldn't see it, but if you look closely, like two of the people on the black side got guns. They got pipes. They got poles. You know what I'm saying? So it's like they really could have just cleared everything out. But for whatever reason, they didn't. You know what I'm saying? Your guess is just as good as mine. For whatever reason, they ain't start blowing. You know what I'm saying? And you know, the Venezuelans, I think, you know, I think the, the blacks in the front and the Venezuelans in the front, they ended up getting off like you know what i'm saying they you know a few people start throwing punches at each other i think you know what i'm saying maybe a few bats was uh swung and shit like that few poles few bottles god damn it few wooden sticks you know what i'm saying like you know probably a person on both ends probably got hit with a pole here hit with a stick there god damn it you know what i'm saying hitting the leg with a with a with a uh with a bottle here but i don't ain't no real serious injuries come up out of it and shit like that. And you know, um, I seen some people in the comments saying, they was like, man, if that was they, if them black people had ran into some other people that was black like them, they would have shot their ass. You know what I'm saying? I seen that shit in the comments. They like, man, the self-hatred is real. If that was a group, another group of black people that y'all ran into, y'all would have unloaded y'all guns. Y'all would have unloaded y'all guns but for whatever reason, since it, they wasn't black, y'all just fought. Y'all just fought. And the Venezuelans looked like they got the best of y'all on the fighting side. Like, it looked like the black people was, like, backing up. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't going to lie, fool. Like, I did notice that shit, too. I seen the gun. You know what I'm saying? I seen both the guns, you know? And... You know, the whole time it's like, you know, they kind of did let the Venezuelans push on them, you know, while they had guns. And, you know, I ain't going to lie, man, like shit. Like, the way that they was pushing on y'all, bro, I ain't going to lie, man, like shit. Like, it would I ain't going to lie, I would have shot my gun. I ain't going to lie, like, the way that they was pushing, the way that they was pushing on y'all, like, I would have shot my gun, bro. I would have popped one of their ass just because, like, they was deep as hell and they pushing on us. It's like they pushing on us, like, and, like, they got us outnumbered, and, you know, and it's like they ass on some, really on some other shit, like, and it's like, man, especially due to, like, like, since we know what we know, like, y'all lads not even from here, bro. Y'all coming over here in our neighborhoods trying to push on us, trying to move in, and goddamn it. Feel like y'all taking over some shit. Like, yeah, it would have been an issue. I ain't even gonna lie to you, bro. It would have, it would have been an issue. But the whole time, sometimes you can't even shoot your gun because goofy ass people like that damn girl who up her phone always want to get some shit on camera. Now, if I would have shot my gun, I'm going to jail now because everybody want to go viral on some weird shit. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get them up off us, but you up in cameras and. Getting this shit on video, uploading it to Reddit and Facebook and Instagram and shit. Now I'm going to jail for uh, uh, discharging a firearm and shit like and all that goof ass shit. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like now I'm going to jail 
because you know what I'm saying for getting them up off us. But I'm going to jail for your goof ass uploading the video. Like you know what I'm saying? Like you know. But um, yeah, man, that video was crazy, man. You know. But shit. Hey, look, man. Stop being scared of them damn Venezuelans. Tell your homies. Tell your homegirls that be in the in, the, in y'all crowds and shit. Put their damn phones down. Quit getting the shit on camera. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I can get them up off us without the fear of going to jail because you want to press, you want to record this shit. You know, y'all need to start checking the females in y'all groups or checking whoever in y'all groups who are always up in cameras and trying to get some shit on, get some footage of some shit. My son, you know. But, um, yeah, man, that shit was wild, man. Y'all hop in the comments, y'all let me know what y'all think about that shit. Bro, some money, y'all, I'll be flexing when I'm drunk and shit. These bitches mad at me, they throw their phone, they be like, fuck this, smoking big granddaddy, little phone, them overstuff my blood and shit.